Tyken oil chiller units provide a variety of different ways it can troubleshoot alarms on the unit as far as for low voltage, oil flow, and also cooling issues. To access your alarm history, you will hold the right hand button until you see the alarms pop up. This will give you the ability to scroll up and down through each alarm in the history to help with the diagnosis. To get out of the alarms, you'll press the enter button all the way to the left and you'll be back into your standard mode screen. When an L9 occurs, the three main causes will be a faulty compressor, an incorrect wiring to the compressor, or a faulty CPU board. When an L9 alarm occurs, first steps are to remove the top cover, locate the compressor wiring, ensure all connections are correct, then you'll move back to the compressor, remove the cap off the top of the compressor, Check all connections inside the compressor. If all connections are correct in those shorts, the PC board is going to be the issue. When the problem with the chiller has been remedied, you will have to cycle the machine power, allow for 10 seconds, and then power back up, and the alarm on the chiller unit should be clear.